Hey guys, <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to my channel. You know, you, uh, uh, hey guys, three main shades to shoot, three main shades to shoot. Oh, uh, so I'm just gonna be doing an eyeshadow base look to do the comparity. I don't what am I even saying? So I'm simply just going to be focusing on a eyeshadow look. Uh, attention to your eyes and up your eyeshadow. You cannot, you cannot, you cannot. You cannot embarrass me like this. My lights want to embarrass me. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Jenny Fine. How are you guys doing? I hope you are doing well fine okay so for today's video I am gonna be doing one of my versus video I haven't done any of versus video for a long time now so I feel like yeah let me bring this out there so the versus video I'll be doing I'm gonna be comparing two um, different brands eyeshadow primer together to see the pigmentivity I don't know if that is a word to see the difference between what formula or what ingredients or what texture is in which I hope what I just said makes sense I have done a versus video of a eyeshadow primer brand before and it's on my channel I'm gonna leave the link right here hopefully you can check it out and that is the Urban Decay versus P. Louise base eyeshadow primer but for today's video I am gonna be doing Juvie's Place eyeshadow primer versus P. Louise base eyeshadow primer reason B is P. Louise is something I use regularly all the time just as I was using my Urban Decay um, Juvie's Place is more like a drugstore kind of affordable brand as well so it's like for them to do um, an eyeshadow primer I want to see how good it is if it's something I'm going to keep on using or, or if it's something I'm just going to like mm, may leave it out there you get what I'm trying to say um, I don't want to talk too much for this video I just want to go straight into it but before I start uh, thank you for my new subscribers and if you're new yet thank you very much I really really appreciate you and you're welcome to the Jenny Fine Club okay please enjoy my uploads my video and don't forget to subscribe like share this video if possible but i'd really don't say share but you know do whatever i'm simply just gonna be focusing on an eyeshadow look for this primer and no foundation nothing like that so i hope so i what side am i gonna be using for my versus video Mm -hmm. okay i'm gonna be using this side for my p lewis base and this side for my juvia's place eyeshadow primer so mind you p lewis is about 10 pounds yeah and it's a uk brand um eyeshadow primer so it's shipping wise is very easy and i think they also ship worldwide as well and they also available in morphe website in the u.s and uk so if you can't get it from the shop directly from p louis space you can also get it from other sub let shops or sublet brand like morphe show or morphe stores in america or anywhere else Juvie's Place eyeshadow primer is a American product or American brand and they just have sublet um, stores in the UK in Superdrug so if you can't get it from their shop direct on their website you can also get it at Superdrug any Superdrug I think or Superdrug website so it can also ship to you I think price wise in the UK is about £12 and in the US about $12 or so so just two dollars different so this is more like a high-end product it's more like close to that but 
more of a drugstore product so but this is expensive why why are you 12 pounds and you you are 10 pounds like why so basically P. Louise have various eyeshadow base primer from colorful primers to skin to primers and they have many colors to choose from why Jesus place just have three main shades to choose from so you can have a very um, light one to a very not too dark but brown kind of um base so I think this is in the middle this is not this is the second base I, I guess so this is shade two definitely shade two so because they come out with three and this is number five room of number it's called room number five but this is um number five shade five they have like six seven other shades after that so ingredient wise i'm not going to go down into ingredient wise because there's ingredients in this back of this packaging but on this packaging there's no ingredients so yeah so before i talk about the packaging wise let me quickly apply this to my eyes um whatever not my eyes directly but um my eyelids so we can start blending so i'm going to work with one eyes at a time so i'm going to apply the um p lewis base number five onto my left eyelid and then i blend it out before i am um, apply the juvenile place to my right eyelid so a little goes a long way so you just have to not put too much just put a generous amount then you blend it yep a generous amount and you can blend it out i'm using a dense blender brush okay you can use anything you're using blending your concealer um out to blend these out so one this is blended so it's set so i'm going over to my juvis place um it's called eye prep eye prime eye primer too many i i i and this is shade two okay it's you can see it's a bit different color it's a bit more brighter than this so it's very it's not too liquid it's like it's not a i don't know how to explain the texture kind of not watery but very very loose liquidy um but also thick concealer texture but fam you know what i'm trying to say i'm going to use the same blending brush to blend that out because this is what i use in blending my my concealer and also my eyeshadow primer yes yes you want to careful you want to do a tapping motion so you it doesn't um you don't remove the primer base from your eyes you want to be careful it's two different eyeshadow color base but they're gonna do the same work so it's just a magic um 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 right i'm gonna be using a juvis place eyeshadow for this um tutorial for this eye look and i'm gonna kind of like create one lovely sexy eye eye look yeah with this three palette so i'm going to be using the berries by juvia's the violet by juvia's and the blushed rose by juvia place palette and also i'm going to be using the same brushes for both sides of the eyes so we just want to know the eye primer base we not we're not trying to compare an eyeshadow together so there's no point on using different eyeshadow brushes you get what i'm trying to say so i'm kind of like pick some brushes that i want yes i don't know what look i'm gonna go for but i'm gonna go for a very dark thing so if we have to fast forward this place we gotta because men i don't have anything to say Hmm. Yeah. I think I just I would just literally apply the eyeshadow together 
so instead of me waiting and trying to do both i just apply them at the same time like i normally would if i wait to like mm -hmm. So I go over with a light pink because that's what I did first. I like dark pink. Okay. The look I'm going for. I'm not really doing a cut crease, it's just a blended eyeshadow. And the wooded eyes. Okay. Light pink. This pillowy side, like so gorgeous. Once we have that, let's go to our violets. We can mix that together. I use this eyeshadow for my friends. I look a bit it um makeup. It was Bang it because she has a good eyelid. Oh, yes. I think I need a better brush for that. It's not doing me justice. Honestly, I love the eyes. I love the eyes. But the thing is, are we gonna? So we just need to um, cover it up, I guess. Close it up. Oh, that's a nice brown shade. But I'm gonna use this dark purple. Mess with that just to close it up. Mm -hmm. yep. Could have used like a not too big brush, kind of to do this, but my brain is like, just use this, like. But no, no, no. Ask cast the demi. Oh, 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 Why you open my door? The heat will come up on your room after the door, the light. Before I call anybody back, I need to finish this eye look. Mm. Yes, yeah, send me a message. Three choices in yours. Why are you fucking sending me to tell me the choices? Your fam, I am busy. Yeah, I'll just get your message. Sorry, I was just doing something. No, it's fine. Yeah, it's alright. Everything's booked. 
all good. I spoke to my mum. She said that she could do from eight. She's finishing at seven, past six, seven. So anytime from eight. If you want to come to mine, come to mine. If I, you want me to come to you, anyway. I'll okay. I think this is it. Okay. This is our finished eyeshadow look for the vessels of our Juvis Place eyeshadow primer and P. Lewis Base eyeshadow primer okay sorry I'm a bit confusing you let's recap this side this side of our face which is the left side is our P. Lewis eyeshadow primer base we use for this eye look and this right hand side of our face is our Juvis Place eyeshadow primer we use for the look bold elegant you know if i were to put like a liner uh um a graphic or colorful liner just to cover the crease it would be pop and also a um eyeshadow as not eyeshadow a lashes as well everything will just be on deck um so guys um what do we think about this there's really no much difference in terms of like pigmentation the eyeshadows Juvis place eyeshadow is known for its colorful pigmented coverage base or eyeshadows so in terms of the primer itself i can't really see much different but to me when i was applying the eyeshadow i felt like these i have minimal effort to make the color pop or stay where i want it to stay with these i have more effort to kind of like constantly going back tapping popping the eyeshadows to kind of like being pigmented like i want it to be or where i want it to be like in terms of like this pink shade i kind of went back and front several times to actually have a good definition of placement and pigmentation i want from it regardless of <coughs> regardless that i'm wearing a eyeshadow base whereas, whereas this one i just had two brush strokes and the placement is already there you wouldn't tell that <laughs> it's two different eyeshadow primer i'm using this looks more smoother this looks more color payout but I don't, I don't even know what i'm talking about because it's difficult for me to know this one definitely this is more smoother and more cool this is not really that smooth but it's okay it's kind of like pigment it could be the base of the color because this is a bit like close to my skin tone and it's a bit brighter than this one so that's why it's a bit more like pigmented over here but reality the result like they both look alike they both look the same so yeah which one is my favorite really i don't have a favorite i feel like i will use them both equally whenever i feel like i want to so if i want to have a pillowy base moment i would do if i want to have a juvie's place moment i would do but yeah in terms of like uh preference i really don't have any preference it's just that it does the work for those of you who don't understand eyeshadow base or who are not used to wearing eyeshadow base eyeshadow base is to actually bring out your eyeshadow look your eyes more out like the attention to your eyes and up your eyeshadow you cannot embarrass me like this my lights want to embarrass me how can you do that when i'm talking how can you do that sorry guys like that light actually got me distracted a bit so what was i saying um i don't really have preference of which side i'm gonna choose i own them so i'll use them whenever i want like i was saying if you don't know about eyeshadow base or if you're not used to wearing eyeshadow base just as you have a face primer for your foundation if you're oily or dry skin that's how there is a eyeshadow primer for your eyeshadow powdered base whether you are combination skin or not the main purpose is to bring out your eyeshadow 
you know make it pop out from your skin also to make your eyeshadow last longer because sometimes when you don't wear a primer and you just slap on your eyeshadow on your bare skin maybe on a concealer before an hour or half an hour into that makeup you have creases on your eyes you have sweat on your eyes and you have movement from your eyeshadow on your eyelid that that's because you're not wearing an eyeshadow primer but if you're wearing an eyeshadow primer it reduces any of those things to happen to you so it literally makes your eye look not last longer and more pigmented and less creasing that's my purpose so my preference for affordability if you feel like you can get your hands on this without shipping you can go to superdrug and get it 12 pounds if you think you can get these and you pay for the shipping you can you can also go to westfield where they sell this you can also get this 10 pound so yes and again this this both products are a lot so less is more so don't put too much to like feel like it's not your concealer it's not your foundation so when you put little that goes a long way then you blend it out then you put a lot you have too much and by the, by the time you start putting your eyeshadow it becomes too cakey so i think i've cleared that out packaging wise i feel like um juvia's place definitely copied p lewis packaging wise because at that time P. Louise was kind of like trending it was like favorite eyeshadow primer most influencers or people into makeup were using so in a way Juvia's Place trying to copy the packaging to kind of like remove the attraction and attention from that to them you get what I'm trying to say because if you look at it it's both the same tubey shape okay um the same yeah the same height I guess the same cap but of course different coloring like brand coloring this is p louise based brand coloring like you have a gold cap and a black and kind of like body and white juvia's has this tune tone color to their packaging orange and kind of like um aqua green so in a way by the end of the day this got um a see-through for your eyeshadow primer same with p louise you got a see-through for your eyeshadow primer so in reality the both the same tubey packaging which is very good and very handy um lots of um liquid and um lots of product inside that can last you for a long time but packaging wise Juvia's place actually copied pillowies see okay see what i'm talking about so in reality Juvia's place kind of like a dupe for pillowies i didn't say that so guys this is the end of our versus video our pillowies base and our Juvia's place okay so it depends on which one you want to get i don't really have a preference i like them okay i've used juvia's play stuff so i really know their products are worthy so yeah yeah okay right if you do enjoy this video thank you guys very much or if you made it to the end of this video thank you very much and if you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe before you go like is really really appreciated and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up like like it subscribe share and if you want to get notification on whenever i upload a video kindly click on that notification bell icon i i upload video every week so hopefully i'm gonna see you in my next video mm, hopefully soon up oh, yeah you get what i mean um yeah that's it guys and thank you for my new subscribers from the Air Force family i would i would i want to say thank you and i appreciate you and i will see you on my next video so be good to yourself love yourself and take care of yourself and peace <laughs> peace out